Hey guys, it's the Frugal Nista doing two videos in one. I'm doing a tag video and this is a take along video. Y'all are tagging along with me while I look for some free stuff. A couple of you guys said y'all wanted to go and I said, okay, I'll take y'all. So we're doing two videos in one. The first is a tag. Now, I was tagged by Lisa from Lisa with an E. I'll link her channel below. Hey, Lisa, I know you thought I had forgotten about you, but I did not. I was tagged over a month ago in the Have You Ever tag. I wanted to do it, been real busy, and I said, let me do it today. So I printed the, you know, Have I Ever questions out, and I'm going to do this while I am doing live, trying to find me some free stuff on a beautiful Sunday afternoon. So let's get started with the Have You Ever tag. There are a bunch of questions. The reason I'm combining this is, is because the Frugal Nista, despite me being like, you know, free finding vixen you know on youtube i'm kind of a boring person guys so most of these questions i can just basically answer with one word answers so let me start the tag have you ever fired a gun no been married yes fell in love of course going on a blind date no skip school not all day now when we were back in like i used to be a hall monitor or office monitor we used to you know skip lunch and then come back to school but i would leave off campus for lunch but come back we weren't supposed to be doing it so uh but no i haven't skipped school a whole day the frugal nisa was a good girl back in the day uh watch someone give birth myself watch someone die no been to canada yes been to hawaii no been to europe no been to vegas no been to washington dc yes been to nashville yes visited florida yes i used to live in florida visited Mexico no seen the Grand Canyon in person and no I would like to though flown in a helicopter no been on a cruise yes but not like the like not like a seven night seven whatever seven night seven day cruise type no when I lived in Florida I used to go on uh, several parties and um, they would be called cruises to nowhere so so technically I have been on a cruise but not like a overnight you know out to sea for days type cruise no i and i and i don't have a desire to have y'all seen the titanic well the lady reading the bedtime story to her children as they get ready to you know leave up out of here that would be the frugal nista because i can't swim and i just have um i probably would take me and my children we go somewhere and just say okay god you know here we come all right um served on jury no been in a movie? No. Been to Los Angeles? No. Been to New York City? Yes. Played in a band? Yes. Sang karaoke? Yes. You know come on, come on. Well, let me you put your hands up. Hands up. Fellas, tell the lady she's, she's the one. one. Put your hands up. Hands up. Grab the back of the head. Look him right in his eye and said, we've been too strong for too long. I know that's right. Yes. I'll be waiting till you up to get home. I'm going to ask you, where you been? Where have you been? We coming up here any time of night if they're going to be just waiting on you now. Okay. Watch this. Made prank phone calls, yes. Laugh so much you pee your pants, yes. But not where it, I, you know, you could tell I, you know, urinated on myself. But I have laughed hard and been like, ooh, you know, one of those types. Um, caught a snowflake on your tongue, yes. Had children. I have two, two girls, y'all know them, Magnolia and Mirabella. Had a pet, yes. Been sledding on a big hill, yes. Been downhill skiing, no. Been water skiing, no. Rode a motorcycle, no. Jumped out of a plane, hell no, <laughs> okay. Been 
to a drive-in movie? Yes. Rode an elephant? No. Been on TV? Yes. Been in a newspaper? Yes. Stayed in the hospital? Yes. Donated blood? No. Gotten a piercing? I have my ears pierced. Gotten a tattoo? No. Driven a stick shift vehicle? No. Well, wait a minute. Yeah, no. No. Driven over 800 miles per hour? No. Been scuba diving? No. Lived on your own? Yes. Rode in the back of a police car? No. Got a speeding ticket? Yes. I have received two speeding tickets in my entire life. One was back when I was in college and I got one recently about three years ago. I was doing 40 and like a 25, something like that. So that's it with the have I ever tag. Again, Lisa, thank you so much for tagging me. Now today I've been out doing some free finding. And the one reason I don't like taking y'all with me is too much trouble. Like I'm turning on and off stuff and I'm looking around and trying not to drop my phone and paying attention to my car. So all I do is just come in and peek, guys. I had a bunch of questions about the trash. See how clean it is? Just a bunch of foam boards. And then that's all I do. I don't stay out there too long and I don't get in. And I know I probably could find a lot more if I did get in and probably stayed out longer, but that's it. That's all I do. I went to two places and I'll show you guys what I found. Talk a little bit about that. I bring my gloves. I don't wear them all the time, but I make sure I have my gloves. I make sure I have my little hand sanitizer. I get these from Dollar Tree. They, um, I like these because they they don't make your hands sticky. I use them to wipe down my you know steering wheel and around me. And sometimes um, the trash isn't seriously, guys, that icky. I use them to wipe down my gloves and stuff like that. Time, especially if you avoid places that serve prepared food. Like right now, I'm sitting outside of a Panera Bread. If you go to the Carter's place and they happen to share a dumpster with that same Panera Bread you're going to be messing around with some icky trash because it's food. Um, food, flies, you know, I don't even look in those because I don't want to see that. As you can see, the place where I checked, it was just basically styrofoam, plastic boxes. Uh, occasionally, you might run into somebody's turkey sandwich that they have for lunch. But generally, retail trash is pretty clean, as you can see, guys. But I want to show you this. I stopped at Michael's right before I got here. And look what I found for free. Look how beautiful. I'm putting on gloves because I don't know if it's glass on it. Uh, I generally wear the gloves just to protect my fingers from glass. Not necessarily, you know, for the icky stuff. Because I really don't run into icky stuff. Uh, but just in case I do, I have gloves in my wipes. So that is a beautiful mercury um, glass. Looks like a Voltive holder. It was in a box with a bunch of them. And I only picked up one. The other one could have very well been okay, but... I was kind of in and out and I picked up this beautiful mercury glass and I just stopped um, while I'm waiting here. I'm going to go back because somebody was on a smoke break. But when I, right as I was looking, look what I found, guys. Ah, beautiful. Look how pretty. Look at the inside of it. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful white bag and some great bubble wrap. I'll use that also gorgeous white bag and I mean nothing on it white and pink gorgeous really really pretty people gonna be wondering what I'm doing what I'm doing a haul very happy to have found that especially for the summertime and then look at this one a beautiful silver bag and that's just me peeking real quick we'll look on the inside of that there's a bunch of bubble wrap in there that I will use and I mean, nothing wrong with that. It must have been part of a giveaway or something, but I grabbed it and I'm going back to look for more. So y'all come on with me while I look for some more stuff. I may not be able to take it out because here I like to get in and out because technically it's not in the back of the store. So yeah, but aren't those cute? So I'm gonna go back over there. I came over here to do my tag, um, but I'm going back over there. I wanna see if homegirl is still on her smoke smoke break. And we're going to see if we can find some more free stuff. I have actually two more places I want to stop before I go home. 
and I'm gonna take you guys with me since you guys asked to see how I do it so yeah and I, I apologize for not taking my camera with me because you know I do this by myself my goal is to be getting some free stuff as a byproduct if you guys see me do it that's you know a two for one but my main goal is to get some free stuff so I'm not I don't really have time to be fumbling around with my camera and stuff uh, so but if I get a chance to take it out I will so let's go okay guys let's go to work And thanks so much for watching guys sometimes you find stuff and sometimes you don't so I had in mind on finding something that I really wanted to find I didn't but I found two beautiful bags and a gorgeous uh, piece of mercury glass yep thanks for watching guys thanks for Lisa for tagging me I'll have all her, her information down below appreciate you watching bye guys enjoy the rest of this beautiful Sunday